Did you know that vitiligo affects 1% of the world's population? That's nearly 80 million people living with white patches on their skin. Today I'm excited to talk about Roxolitinib cream, a groundbreaking new treatment that's changing lives for people with vitiligo. What is vitiligo? Vitiligo is an autoimmune condition, which means our own immune system mistakenly attacks our own melanocytes, the cells that give skin its color. This creates white patches on the skin, and this can occur any part of the body, particularly on the face, but also on the trunk and limbs, and usually the visible areas. For many people with vitiligo, it significantly impacts their confidence and also the quality of their life. How does Ruxolotinib cream work? It's a type of Jack or Janus kinase inhibitor, which means it blocks certain enzymes that control inflammation. In vitiligo, blocking these enzymes helps to protect the pigment cells from breaking down, and this can slowly bring the color back to the white patches. It's approved for anybody above the age of 12 years, and a non-segmental vitiligo. It's the first FDA-approved topical cream for this condition. The effectiveness of ruxolitinib was shown in two clinical studies, which is called True V1 and True V2 studies, which was published in the New England Journal of Medicine a couple of years ago. These studies included 674 patients with non-segmental vitiligo affecting their face. Participants applied ruxolitinib cream twice daily for 24 weeks. More than half the patients saw significant repigmentation on their face after 24 weeks. Results kept improving with longer treatment. Half the patients achieved more than 50% body pigmentation after 52 weeks. Some patients continue to see new pigment forming up to three years after the study. The cream works best for those who have smaller and active patches, particularly on the face. And this has shown consistent results regardless of the age, the skin type, or previous treatments. When it works, repigmentation often starts as tiny colored areas of pigmentation within the white patches, usually around the hair follicles. Color spreads from the edges, and though it may look slightly different initially, it blends in over time. Here are some key points. The face shows better improvement than other areas. People with darker skin often seem to have more noticeable results and progress is gradual. Most significant changes occur after 24 weeks or sometimes even after 52 weeks. Most side effects are mild. It can cause redness, itching and exfoliation at the site of application. About 5% of patients also develop application site acne, which is an unusual side effect for most treatments. Ruxolitinib is not a cure and long-term safety data is still awaited. Some health systems like the NHS in the UK currently do not routinely fund it because of cost-effectiveness concerns. So it's not universally available yet. But this cream offers new hope for those with little life, looking to restore their natural skin color. If you are starting treatment, be patient and consistent. I hope you found this information helpful. Thank you for listening and bye.